So, I mean, obviously you guys just got finished done. Um, I'm expecting to see you sometime before the year is over. Oh, come on now, yeah. yeah. We, we, we want to get in the ring at, at least three more times, at least. At least three. Yeah, but yeah, we're looking at, right now we're looking at June. And um, we, we don't know exactly who will win yet, mm -hmm. but um, we're, we'll be ready. John, Sean being that nice guy, can't say for whatever of course, reason. Of course, of course. know what that is. <laughs> he already knows that the IBF has already said that Tim uh -huh. Riley and Sean Boyle need to fight for right. the title. Now, now the IBF, they, they said they was going to, you know, strip, actually, you know, Lamont based on this fight right. at uh, 140. Now, you're staying at the weight that you are. What yeah, did you I'm think about the saying. IBF just doing that uh, because of the activity and the the layoff. I know. I know you think highly of the organization, mm -hmm. but uh, um, I, I think highly of all of, <laughs> all of the organizations. But you know, um, for me speaking on the IBF, uh, if they want to get me back in there and give me another shot at Kel. I'll take that. I know you want to see Kel based on the last uh, opponent wasn't actually up to your part. Well, you know either. what? Right now we're we are hearing that it's Timothy Bradley um, in uh, in a title eliminator. So mm -hmm. we'll handle that business if if that's what it is. Yeah. Now we yeah we heard that recently there was. A, a decline by the IBF for Timothy Bradley and somebody else, was, but yeah. it wasn't your name mentioned. So no, 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 no you're no, actually no. one of my The story that I was Frankie Gavin, yeah, yeah, and then the calls is you know supposed to be made to us. So um, we accepted all phone calls. Oh, yeah. Now, uh, from what I read, uh, Bradley's <laughs> trainer said that. Uh, they will be fighting in New York June 13th. We're not busy June 13th. Mm -hmm. That's the thing. We buy our own ticket to come here. Not yeah. a problem whatsoever. Tim Bradley's a great fighter. His trainer's a great trainer. And uh, we want to be great. So in order to do that, you got to go up against great fighters. I mean, we obviously know we don't need to buy our own tickets. Basically, we will be ready. Okay. So if, if, if Timothy Bradley is the name that, that they uh, put on the paper and we sign that, that's who we're going to get ready for. Okay, man. Look, Sean Kenny, I'm not going to take up too much of your time. I know you're really situated, man. I like that suit, by the way, man. I got to get your tailor. Thank you. You know, Kenny looking Thank sharp, you. too, over here, man. I don't have a tailor yet. <laughs> <laughs> this guy. All right, Sean Porter. At Sean Porter on Doc. I'll get, you know, give him a follow online. Yeah, Always Twitter. doing stuff, man. Yeah, I saw your training nice partner, Demetrius, around here, too, man. Yeah, he's right I saw here, him man. around yeah, here. We, we chopped it up stuff. quite a bit tonight, and it was good to catch up with him. It's good to be in this area, in this, uh, in this facility tonight, PBC is doing an amazing job and I'm looking forward to getting back in there and doing it again. Hey man, thanks again for your time, brother. Yes, Anything you got to say out there? Bro? Nah, man. I, God bless all you guys. Thank you for your love and your support. What about Twitter, you, Kenny? Instagram, Facebook, <laughs> Showtime Shopping. Kenny, how's that gym going, by the way? I know we last talked about that. Yeah. We, we had to hold that down because we started back training and fighting and here we are turning right back around within the next six to eight weeks yeah. so let's kind of put it on the back burner while we put other people on their backs okay all right thanks for your time kenny